Hello all. So I thought I'd do a quick video on how you can install a VPN on an Asus router, which is pretty easy to do inside of a few steps. And the first thing you're going to need is you're going to need a, a, a VPN provider, which I'm using IPVanish. Uh, you, you could likely use, if you already have one, you could likely use their configuration. But uh, it's just what I'm using to set this up. Uh, if you want to check out IPVanish, I'll put a link in the description. And uh, one of the things you're going to need their configuration files. And uh, I'm going to put a link in the description for this for IPVanish uh, for their configuration files and what it looked like. And before we get into it, we're going to have to download this uh, configs.zip file right here. So go ahead and download that by clicking on it and save it on your computer wherever you want. I've already saved it here. And once it downloads, you're going to want to un extract it by right clicking and uh, right clicking on it and say an extract all and extract it right there which I already did and it's right here and so if you look inside of here it would have all these uh, files inside of here you don't need to touch them right now but just know that they're there each one of these servers is one you can connect to and uh, we'll also need this uh, cer security certificate but once it's extracted just uh, go ahead and minimize out of that and go to your router Asus router main login page which is you open up any browser and you go to the top and you type in http colon four slash four slash router dot aces dot com and that'll bring you up to the main index page for your options on your aces router and once you do that scroll down here to the bottom and you'll see right here it'll say vpn so click on vpn and we're going to be using open vpn which is right here, the center button. So click on open VPN. And then we're going to need to set up a client. So up here at the middle right here, click on VPN client. And I've already set up one connection. You can set up multiple connections as many as you want. That way you could just always connect to a different server, you know, set up each one, like maybe five, 10 servers in case one is busy or goes down for whatever reason. And, but, to set up one right here we're going to click on add profile and over on the right we're going to click open VPN again and give it a name so I'm going to call mine IP vanish 2 uh, the description could be any name for you to remember just remember what it is enter in your username and password for IP vanish for the, for the VPN provider that you have and right here I'm going to say choose file so this is where we need to go to the config file. Mine was inside of downloads and I unzipped it. So I'm going to click on configs and I'm going to scroll down and find a USA server. So say I'm just going to pick anyone here. I'm just going to say Seattle and I'm going to click on upload. Now it's going to say give you this and say lack of certificate authority and that what we got to do is we got to upload that certificate so right here we're going to click this option and we're going to say choose file again click on choose file and right here at the top is caipvanish.com that's their security certificate so we click on that and we click on upload again and once that's done make sure your username and passwords inside of there we're going to click on OK and I already did that with my username and password on this IP vanish number one. So I'm going to click on activate. And once it clicks on activate, you should be able to see like this little blue check mark. That means you're now connected to that uh, server. So everything, all your traffic now from the router is going to be directed through that, uh, for me, IP vanish uh, server. So that's basically it. Hopefully that helps you out. If you have some questions, ask me and uh, I'll try to answer them below. But that's basically it.